Hello everyone, I'm Shohan. So today we will learn how to fire up your first website in localhost. Uh, in this tutorial, I will start a bit uh, further. Uh, I hope you have the XAMPP installed in your PC and at least you have a text editor where you can edit your, ed edit your code. You can use Notepad no problem but uh, I'm, I have the one of the coolest uh, text editor um, currently now which is Sublime and I also have my XAMPP installed. So let's get started so what we have to do we have to start our zam control panel so we need to start here two things one is apache server and the second thing is mysql database mysql database is uh, for those like if you got data to show and retrieve though uh, we will uh, in this tutorial we will just write the world best program hello world in your web page so we will not the mysql so i'm not gonna start it i will just start the apache uh one thing i want to mention for sure that uh, sometime your apache will not start like my one do because maybe you have your skype running background so what skype do it usually uh, block the port number 80 which your apache trying to open so uh, make sure that your Skype is closed and it's closed for your application tray wherever it is maybe on so close your Skype and start the Apache I hope it will work fine so now we will go to the uh, main thing so we have to host our website in your in our local host so for that we have to go to the C drive because our um, XAMPP installed in the C drive and in C drive we will file a, find a folder called XAMPP let's open it and then you will file HD docs HD docs mean hypertext document you know uh, we're gonna use here HTML so hypertext markup language so in this HD docs folder you will have your all websites all folders or all file whatever you say of your website so just open it and now now we we are in the HD docs for uh, folder so now if we just uh, open a new folder let's call it like first call your website whatever you want whatever like I have named my one first that's no big deal so now we have got first that means now if we uh, go in my browser and uh, uh, put a, uh, a link like localhost slash first then I will avail to see all the files in first as a website so this is pretty cool but we have to do a further work so what your browser usually do when um, uh, when you just search like uh, localhost slash first it go inside this and then let's create a new HTML file like let's say one dot HTML now we have got a HTML file which called one.html so let's write a bit of code here I hope uh, you guys know the fundamental of HTML if you don't know no worries and uh, why I'm using this uh, text editor this is super cool and it's got some uh, shortcut you can say so it is very easy to write codes like if you just say HT it will uh, suggest you something do you want to have the HTML yes we do want to have the HTML so on our HTML uh, we we have to have a title title like the uh, hover section on the favicon section I will say I will show you no worries so we will say like uh, like one just the one then we have got our body now we will put something like a header here see I just type h1 and it's saying do you want this tag sure I want it so let's write the world best program hello world oh my typing is very good so uh, we have got hello world and we have to save it and I'm using a keyboard shortcut which is control s uh, and you can see this file is not saved how can I say you see a dot mark here if I press the control s then it's safe now it's safe and now we have got something special like we have got our website link first and then we have got our file like one so let's see we can see this in our browser or not if we can see this then this will be one of the coolest thing so let's just put localhost slash remember our folder name first then we will put our file name one dot 
HTML and press enter hurrah we have done it so we got one which is title and the hello world and now you can see we have got the folder first then we have got the file uh, uh, mainly what you have to do and what I wanted to show you that we are uh, accessing a file under the first folder suppose we just want to have uh, want to write this first and we want to see some outputs though we're not able to see it now so what you have to do let's create an another file we will call it index and we need to call it index why i will describe no problem so what your browser usually do if you just put this link like localhost slash first then it will uh, go uh, into the folder and it will search for the index file do this website have an index file now we have an index file yes so let's put some code on index file so we can determine where we are going to the same thing again and again HTML then we will say this is our index page our title will be index page then we will add a new header this is our index page so let's see what's happened now so we have got index page and we have got one dot html page so if i now try to see what is here like localhost slash first i just put the reload and hurrah we see index page and this is our index page so your browser is going into this folder and searching for index do we have index file yes we have then it will show this and no worries about the second folder like one.html if you still wanted to see uh, this folder uh, file just press this link we say hello world so uh, this is for today this is a very quick uh, tutorial on how to uh, run your first website on uh, localhost so if you got any question you can just uh, leave it on the comment below i will try to answer all of them so uh, have a good day bye bye